Today we are taking a look at Chiano? I'm not actually sure to pronounce this one. If you know how to pronounce it properly, please correct me in the comments below because I'm just going to keep saying Chiano. It might be Ciano. It might be Chiano. I'm guessing Chiano because the C-I just makes me think like a ch sound for some reason. Anyway, Chiano is a simple multimedia file converter for elementary OS. It uses FFmpeg as its backend, and you get a fair number of formats that you can convert to, plenty of video formats, music formats, and image formats. As far as preferences, there's not a whole lot you can customize. It is very simple, as the description implies. You can choose the output folder for where your converted files will go to. I usually leave it as file origin, as that's easier to keep track of, but you can also specify a custom folder by turning that off. And you can also customize the notification settings, so you can be notified about when an action is completed or if there is an error. The way Chiano works is you select the format you'd like to convert to. Let's go with MP4. Click the little icon in the bottom left here to add a file to convert. You can add multiple at once. I'm just going to add one for this example. Like that and start conversion. Once your video is converted, depending on where you selected to output the file to, you should see it with the same name as the original file, but with a different file extension. And as you can see, comparing the two, the converted file is about the tenth the size of the original. Not bad. Now, simplicity is the key word here with Chiano. You do get a wide range of formats that you can convert to. You don't have any control over things such as quality settings, though. It's basically what you have here is what you get. For just simple, quick file conversion, that's perfectly fine. But if you're doing more serious video transcoding, things like that, Chiano might not suit your needs in that situation because you don't have any control over like things like bitrate or codec, things like that. So as far as the MP4 conversion, for example, that does just use H.264 as you would probably expect it to. And from what I can see, the quality doesn't have any visual degradation. However, when I've tried, say, WebM, that did have a noticeable quality drop. I haven't extensively tried the other formats, but that is something to keep in mind. So again, it's great if you need to do a lot of simple, quick file conversion in bulk. Not so good for advanced use. That being said, if you're on elementary yourself and you'd like to give Chiano a try, you can of course get it on App Center for a suggested price of $3.